everybody. I wanted to jump on here really quickly and talk about this TikTok video that is going viral. So I'm posting this video to my page so I can do my part and get as many eyes on this story as can possibly be on this story because I feel so sorry for this man. Now, there was this African-American man in Virginia City, Nevada. Now, you guys probably never heard of Virginia City, Nevada because this was at some point point in the past, a town where all the miners would go to strike gold. No joke. This is a true story. They would go there to get as much gold as they can. Well, when the gold started running out, the town actually became a ghost town. So I don't even know when this town reemerged as a city again, but it's still very, very small. As a matter of fact, if you don't live in Vegas or Reno, there these Nevada has the smallest towns. They should be on some kind of country western movie or something like that. They have these very, very small towns, which I've never experienced in any other state that I lived in. But anyway, this African-American man was down there collecting signatures to lower the price of attorney fees. Now, before I get into the story, this is very important here. You guys know how I feel about attorney fees, okay? They charge you an arm and a leg. So to me, he was doing God's work. But anyway, he came across this man that just walked up to him, this racist guy, and said that uh, the N-word hanging tree is down the street. So take a listen. Keep talking. And where the tree at to hang people at? Where is that? Where is the hanging tree at? In your backyard. No, no, no. He just said there's a hanging tree down there to hang people like me. That's racist. That is. That is racist. Y'all go take his back and he's being racist. He's a crying motherfucker. He's a crying motherfucker. You know what? That is fucking horrible of you. I'm doing a job and I did not disrespect you not once. Oh, man. Come on. Get out of here. Get the fuck out of here. You, man, you know what? Fuck you, and I'm not leaving. Make me leave, motherfucker, because I can't take I don't, it. I don't make trash. I burn it. That's fifth grade. And y'all laughing at this? <laughs> and y'all laughing at this? This is what y'all like? Is this is what they y'all like? We love it, man. We love it. You love it? Get your Betty flag on, man. Come on. Get your Betty on, man. <laughs> And all of y'all accepted this shit. That's right. That's right. We do. Hey, man, I'm having a great day. I'm having a great day. I'm having a great day. <laughs> Fuck all of y'all. And I'm going to stay right here because y'all don't scare me. You got to suck me. What? Got to do what? I built like a lemon. You got to suck me. If this is the way that you're talking on camera to me, sir, and I never disrespected oh, you until you disrespected me. Oh, candid camera, actually. I'm going to be on the 5 o'clock news. No, I'm going to be on house. I thought you said you had a job. I got a job. Well, go do it. Man, fuck you. You do it. Oh, hey, hey. Just go do your job. You do your job. I'm doing See, it. Why do people say those fuck you to everybody? He said fuck me because I can say fuck you too. What the fuck you mean? He's being fucking racist to me, man. Get the fuck out of my face. Get the fuck out of my face. Who the fuck are you? I don't give a fuck. Fuck you too. The fuck? How you doing? Are you are you along with them? Yes, he is. Okay, but why is he being fucking racist to me talking about there's a fucking hanging tree down there? Are you are you along with that? Are you down with that as well, like him? Yeah. Ma'am, don't get out. Don't fucking touch me. Don't touch me. I'm not on your property. Don't touch me. Don't fucking touch me. Don't fucking touch me. Do y'all see this shit? I'm not saying nothing. I'm telling you to get off my property. Fuck you. Now what? Let's do it. Come on, let's go. Slap me, hit me. I want you to. I want you to I hit me. I love you. You're my brother. No, I'm not your brother. You're Don't touch brother. me. This is fucking You're racist to the most. You're, my You're wrong. You're, my You're wrong. You get out You're of my, my face. I don't understand what You're that means. You know where you are. Do you have a history of your parents? I don't give a fuck. I'm not doing anything to anybody. Y'all gonna kill me? Kill me. Kill me. Do it. You're my brother. Do y'all see? Don't touch me. I love you, baby. Are y'all gonna allow this shit to happen? This racist stuff? Now the video is longer. This. 
than this. But I pretty much cut it off because nothing too much different happens. He just continues to yell and everyone continues to gang up on him. And ultimately, the wife and the daughter pushed him down the street, and then he would just turn around and walk away. Now, I don't know why he gave this so much energy. Everybody in this footage is a senior citizen. Me, personally, I don't think I would engage because it's not like your behavior can change anything. Racist people are always going to be racist people. I probably would have just walked away or made the situation worse by sicking my 21-year-old son on him. He would be out in one punch. And then I wouldn't be sitting here making this video because I'd be locked up. I mean, that's the beauty in having sons. I've got two of them. And whenever I tell them to get someone, that's exactly what they do. But he chose to film it. And this might have been a smarter way. People can't deny the power of video. So they woke up the next day and they were all over the news. And developing tonight, officials are investigating a video widely circulating the internet about an incident that occurred in Virginia City. In the video, the videographer, a black man, can be heard claiming the man in the black shirt right there was making racist comments at him. The man then seen laughing at him. Later in the video, a woman followed the videographer as he repeatedly told her not to touch him. The Story County Sheriff's Office has posted a statement saying, quote, We at the Sheriff's Office do not condone or support racism, inequality, or hate speech. A case has been pulled regarding this incident and is being investigated, end quote. The full statement can be found on our website at 2news.com. I mean, the next day, everyone started saying they don't know what happened. They weren't there. They don't agree with what was done. I mean, the power of... The camera is a great thing. So if you guys ever find yourself in this kind of situation or just any kind of sticky situation, pull out those phones, people, and start recording. The man that recorded the video wanted to thank everyone because the power of social media was just overwhelming. Hey, TikTok, what's up? Um, yep, yeah, I'm the guy in the video yesterday that that happened to out in Virginia City, Nevada. I just want to tell everyone, thank y'all for all of y'all support. Thank y'all for coming in and putting y'all comments and finding this guy and finding these people because this is unacceptable. Like, I just want everybody to see that racism don't just go on to person to person. Racism is like in all these little small cities and small towns, as y'all can see. I did nothing wrong to that guy. I was only doing a job and I'm very committed to my job. All I did was ask him when he signed my petition to lower the attorney fees that they have in the state of Nevada. And this guy just started going off and saying all these derogatory, rude, and nasty things. And then his family came outside. And then the chatting and all that in the background, that was very hurtful. Um, I know I could have went about it a little different way, but at that moment, I didn't know what else to do. I was cornered in by a lot of people. I was the only African-American that was there with thousands of other people and nobody came to my help. But I do want to give a shout out to this lady named Tiana. She did come to my help. I want to give out a shout out to everybody on TikTok, Facebook, and Instagram that came to my um, help that was there for me, sending me love. And I thank you guys for all the different messages. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section. Until next time, bye for now.